I'm about to actually step off of the carpet area. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by Freaking.com. Whose office did you say you were with? Should you be working for her? Is it right? Ethical? How much taxpayer money do you receive per year? Generally, so far, there seems to be a disconnect between the event and the students who are here not really paying any attention. So thus far, I'm going to have to give this event a B, a B, a solid B on transparency. I'm getting answers when I ask questions. No one's really trying to shut me up too much. Uh, could be better, could be worse, but mostly worse. Sydney, to what extent does the use of torture undermine... I'm, I'm not sure I'm able to answer your questions. Uh, well, I mean, you're an institution that wants diplomacy, right? Sure, not, How does torture hurt that? I'm not, I'm not here to answer your questions. So, if you, did you RSVP for our precedent? Well, I'm not here to answer yours either. <laughs> I, I know this. Okay. Um, when, our, when our event starts, I mean, this is a public space, so you're welcome to be here. Uh, once our event starts, it is a private event. If you didn't RSVP ahead of time, we're going to have to ask you to stay out here in the hallway. Great. Thank you so much. Take care. Are you a supporter of U.S. global leadership? Or are you? <laughs> to what extent do you support the torture part? Are you with the GLC? Question for you. To what extent does the use of torture undermine your appreciation for diplomacy? Or favoring of it, if any? I saw seven different items on your website that uh, indicated a desire for more spending or support of existing spending. Do you, have you guys ever advocated for any kind of spending reduction? <clears throat> Carpet area because this is all uh, reserved I'm for sorry, our what are you If you could step off of the carpet area into the, the tile area, we've reserved all this for our event. Uh, and since you didn't RSVP for the for the press check in, I'm um, about to actually step off of the carpet area into oh. the into the um, into the hallway. Now I was under the impression from talking to them when I first yep. uh, came up that actually I would only have to sign in. Well, we have, we have, or do it here. We advertised this event to the press and had an RSVP list for press to um, to check in. Uh, and you're not on that list. And so I'm going to ask you to step off into the uh, the tiled space because we've reserved this uh, for our event. Thank you. Uh, on whose authority? Uh, How do you know the boundaries precisely of uh, what's... Because what's, uh, I know what we rented as, as from the university. From the so why aren't you kicking students off when they come onto this? We, we don't have any students that are in this space. I'm beginning to leave, by okay. the way. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. So this is going to be a very slow departure. Are you? In protest, I'm going to leave right down the middle. And now I'm off the carpet. Normally I would stand off to the side, but since they have uh, been bossing me around now, I'm just going to stand right in the middle. So I would have been less in the way if I had been over there on that other of a carpet. People still have room to get past me, just not quite as much as they had before. To what extent does the U.S. use of torture undermine all you accomplished when you were serving? What, what, to what extent does the U.S. use of torture undermine what you accomplished when you were serving? What are you arresting this man for? 
You've seen the dramatic liberty arrests in Keene, New Hampshire. Now see 111 reasons why you should move there and reinforce these gutsy activists. Keene's advantages are compelling, and the list of reasons to move has just been updated. For details, visit freekeen.com.